Listening Dog Media. This is Junction, an original production from Matt May Productions and Listening Dog Media. Starring Steve Kane, Lisa Whiteside and Natalie Sifo. Written by Richard Hearn, produced and directed by Paul Ludden. Almost home, almost home. What the shit? What the no? Hi, Oni, I'm home. You hear? I have had a shitty day. Love? Love? But a day from hell. I have wine. And that junction is a nightmare. I'm still shaking. Fran? Love? Oh, she's not in. Oh, Friday. What does that mean? Pilates night or Prosecco night? The getting a keys night never remembers a keys. Why don't you ever remember? Your... You're not my wife. At least your eyesight's not been affected, Mr. John Foster. I'm Lucy from the insurance company. How do you do? That's very formal, but seeing as you ask, actually, I, I know how you do. Um, do you know what? I, I shouldn't have asked. Do you know what? I'm glad you did. Not had a chance to tell anyone. Crappy day at work, and I've crashed my car on the way home at that junction. Oh, maybe I shouldn't have told you that. You're from the insurance company, you say. Uh, this wine, I've had this since, not before, since. You want one? No. And yes, I, I did already know that you've had a bad day. It wasn't my fault. Uh, there was a jogger on the road. It, it was dark. And... What, what do you mean you already know? Is your wife here? No. Should she be? She's a worrier. It's probably best she's not here until I've settled down. So, oh, Mr... J- John, please, j- just let's keep it... Uh, Pretend. Uh, informal. But I-, I don't really get it. I, I don't remember calling it. You're much more efficient than my last car insurance company. I'm not from your car insurance company. I'm from Life. Well, anyway, it's good to see you've been so quick, whatever departments. Life. I, I don't understand. Oh, well, this is awkward. Hashtag awkward. <laughs> Sorry, I'm a, I'm a bit nervous. Actually, a glass of water would be good. This sort of thing makes your throat dry. That's ever so kind. You've gone quite pale, like you've seen a... Oh, no, 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 please. Um, don't say that. I don't want you to be worried about me. Um, you mind if I... Did you see who on that junction? Uh, it, it, it was be- from behind, dark. They, they had the hood up. Strange thing was, it looked like a top I've got. I, I didn't crash into them, but I had to swerve off the road. It's, it's all a blur, really. I've just realised... That you haven't realised. Uh, what does that mean? Oh, my God. Am I concussed? How many fingers am I holding up? With concussion, I'm supposed to be the one holding the fingers. But three, seeing as you asked. Look, let's go back to the beginning. You logged onto our website for life insurance. You filled in a form, all the usual details, plus we do offer added value over our competitors. There was a particular box that you ticked. You ticked a box that no one has ever ticked before. It was a new box, which is why I'm not used to this. Me, here and everything, if you see what I mean. Me, here and everything? Is that a Bee Gees song? (laughs) Very good. So with insurance, you can add things like critical illness cover, something serious that might affect your income. I remember taking that. Better safe than sorry. Quite. Okay, so imagine you chose the one up from that. Actually, don't imagine, because you did. You ticked fatal illness cover, brackets, gold premium, close brackets. Gotcha. 
did I? I, I ticked a lot of boxes. Is, is that good? Um, define good. I mean, it's very robust cover, so I suppose you'd say that was good. But if I turn up to discuss it, it's probably less healthy. What? What? Christ, what are you saying? I'm saying your fatal illness cover, brackets, gold premium, close brackets, has been activated. I don't think you normally heard when your own life insurance gets activated. Wouldn't I have noticed? The, the, the premium, wouldn't that be quite a bit higher? Like, massive? No one would choose it, which is why instead we put a in a post-activation premium. It's, it's in our terms. Well, no one reads the terms. You should. Well, I will from no one. So you've come round here to give me my payout. Uh, that's how it works, doesn't it? Insurance? Your payout is that you're still here. Talking to me. Alive. You can sit down if you want. I think I need to lie down. Uh, you're here to break the news that I've died. No, I'm... I'm here to change the news. That's the benefit of the cover. Just a signature, permission, consent. That's a GDPR buzzword. I don't get it. I, I get to cheat death. Remember the terms? Oh, I forgot. You don't read the terms. When you sign, the charge is transferred. The cost is transferred. The cost to you is... You know. I don't know. I mean, you know. The cost is knowledge that this fate has been transferred. Given to someone else? In a d in an event such as yours, where there is another party... Party? Event? It all sounds so bloody positive. But there wasn't another party. Uh, there was a jogger, but not a car. It's not car insurance, remember. Life insurance. It's about the other life. The other party is another life. Let's use your junction. It's a handy metaphor. You get there, we've paused things, or rather, we've allowed ourselves a small rewind. You die. Or you activate our policy and the other side dies. You get to choose. Like you would at a junction. The jogger, you reckon? Uh, I've chosen to kill someone with this policy, instead of me. Not yet. That happens when you sign this form. How can I do this? How can I transfer my own death to, to, to someone else? I, I can't sign that. If you don't, nature takes its original course. There'll be no now on that you mentioned earlier. Uh, I know it's old-fashioned, but my, my wife calls me the protector. Is that sexist? It isn't fear. It isn't, it isn't, it isn't, it isn't. Think, John, think. It's not just me I have to think about. I'm, I'm protecting my wife, too. If I die, I, I can't look after her. So it's me and her, us, versus someone random. That, that, that is what you're saying, isn't it? The, the person. The jogger. I can't confirm. Really, I don't know. I don't have the information. I get sent that after. Is this so life ends? Food informs and frustrated at me. Christ. Oh, God. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. Is, is, is there a, a, a cooling off period? No, except I suppose you're in it. That's how the body works. Cooling off, shutting down. Sorry, that was a stupid joke. But no, the disclaimer, activating the post-activation premium is non-reversible. Well... A digital signature. There's no time to waste. Well, what happens to the, the, the other party? I visit them. It happens much like you here. There's no special magic. I cross-reference, locate them. An address will pop up on my screen. I go. I ring the doorbell. It's a different script. Shorter. I'll try not to be nervous this time. You give them an option, like me, or is that it for them? The end? I don't give them an option. I just give them the news. Hi, honey. I'm home. Fran, you've got your keys? Yeah, of course I've got my keys, Olivia. Are you trying to tell me something? 
And what's the matter with you? Oh, give me a hug. Stop it. Oh, God, I'm all sweaty. You're so cold, John. Sorry, I've just had the weirdest day. Oh, thank God, you're back. Yeah, but you're warming up now, though. Did, did, did you see someone leave just as you came in? No. Should I? <laughs> no, no, I, I, th I think I'm going mad. <laughs> Where have you been? Oh, jogging. Well, don't worry, I am not doing that again. Not this late, anyway. Some idiot almost crashed into me. I saw him swerve. I'd gone up the cycle path and then across, you know, that junction. You know the one I mean. Uh, that's my hoodie. I almost got hit by a car and you bothered that I borrowed your hoodie. Oh, Christ, God. I'm sorry. I'm whoa, whoa, whoa. So Steady. sorry. I, I was just joking. Look at me. Look at me. I'm fine. I'm fine. Although, it's getting a bit cold in here, isn't it? Oh, don't, Fran. Don't. I'm sorry. The Pod Play.